This one was another extremely late song to come onto the album. Yeah. We have different opinions on this one <laughs> because I think this is the saddest, well, one of the saddest songs on the album. Really? And you have an opposite opinion on I that. have a, com I, this is one of, this is my favorite song on the album. I think it's so uplifting. I, 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 I don't know, like I, what I take from it is that it's, it's a, there's very much like a hint of sadness. Maybe it's just a, maybe there's just a raw emotion to it. Mm. Maybe it's that it comes after Shanghai, so you're like, you know, you're you're kind of in that sort of headspace yeah. anyway. But um, the the other thing you have to remember is that I'm looking at the instrumentation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is sort of the most not necessarily progressive in like the sort of prog genty way, but this has its own kind of it has its own story. It's not necessarily symmetrical. Mm -hmm. Uh, like you know, some of like the singles might be because mm -hmm. yeah, that's that's just how they came out. The interesting fact about this one and the whole album is that all of the kind of choir parts on it are done. <laughs> are they done by a teachers' choir? It's a <laughs> Surbiton High School teachers' choir. Yeah. Uh, and they went and, and recorded them for a day, which I found <laughs> which I found really funny. <laughs> I didn't realise it was happening. And then, they were, then I just get a photo from Ed, our old guitarist, and Kyle, mm -hmm. who were um, <laughs> just like, yeah, we're at service in the school. <laughs> just, <laughs> just, um, just, uh, just doing this. So uh, yeah, anytime you hear any sort of choral voice, that's uh, that's where yeah. it came from. Yeah, I do love that bit as well on this track. I like it as well. It's uh, it's. It's interesting. It, it, this is one of the ones. It's like it's weird. It, it's weird sitting down and talking through every song mm. because you realise like just how varied it is. Yeah. <laughs> like, like yeah. We we go through a lot of different uh, sort of changes, and uh, this song is a uh, you know is one one of our strongest, and it felt like the full stop that we needed for this for this chapter of the band. Yes. It felt like a f both. It felt good because it felt like a full stop and a, a jumping off point. I yeah. think for me. Yeah, I mean and that was reflected in the lyrics as well. You yeah, know, the lyrics absolutely. are all that they're, they're talking about. Um, it is. I mean, literally, you know, that the first line in the chorus, "The smoke cleared and I'm still standing." Mm. That yeah. I think that pretty much sums up the entire yeah. song, and it also sums up the entire recording process yeah. for this oh. album. <laughs> yes. <laughs> The smoke yeah. clip, the charred earth. Yeah, you yeah. had to get through, you know, a whole load of crap, but yeah. at the end of it, you're still there and you're better for it. Mm. Um, yeah, this this song is my favourite lyrically as well because that so that's the broader meaning of it, but the inspiration for that came from a personal place, mm. and the personal place that it came from was from having people in in my life previously who doubted me and who didn't think that I was going to do things and it's it's being able to not even say to their faces but just being being myself and and doing the things that I'm doing I know that they can see that I am doing something I haven't just become nothing which is what they expected of me mm. um, the reason it's called might and main was because I wanted something that really sums up I mean, it sums up the song, but it also sums up the album, which is why we ended up calling the album With Might and Main, because that phrase, that phrase means with all one strength. And I think that we all, we all gave our absolute best to, to end up with the album that we got. Yeah. And so I think that With Might and Main was, was a really good representation of, of that. Yeah, I think so. So yeah, that's, that's where the, the song came from.